With Halloween just five days away, many events are popping up along the Central Coast this weekend to celebrate. Our community reporter Lindsay Hyatt visited the Woods Humane Society today to get the latest on one of them. I stopped by Woods Humane Society to see some pets in the holiday spirit and found an owner in the spirit of giving instead. I spoke with the 11-year-old fundraiser about his passion for animals and philanthropy. Along with animal costumes and local vendors, attendees of the Wiggle Waggle Fall Festival could also check out calendars featuring community pets. Of the more than 100 people who fundraise for Woods, only the top 10 secured a spot in the calendar, and only one of those was a child. 11-year-old Max Flum. I feel bad for the animals. I feel like they should have help until they have happy home. So for the past three years, he provided that help, raising funds for the animals at Woods. The first year with the lemonade stand, I raised about $80. During the next two years, he raised over $2,000 for Woods. He was the only youth and two years in a row he has successfully fundraised to get into the calendar. We just love him. Woods CEO Emily LaRue said that money all goes towards Woods' mission. With every dollar donated, that helped animals that needed to be adopted, spayed or neutered, pet pantry, microchips, and vaccines. Max encourages other kids to start fundraising too. Just in San Luis Obispo, Lindsay Hyatt, KSBY News.